Hello everyone, this is Rookie, and welcome back to Wicked Willow. Let's continue where we last left off, shall we? Where we last left off, uh, Lydia is about to start World War III. So yeah, we are continuing with this game since it is uh, June of this year, 2024. It is Pride Month this year, so I am literally only going to play Pride, Pride Month games. I mean, LGBTQ plus games. That's all I'm going to play this month. Until, until July, then we go back to our normal games. We play. Alrighty, so let's get started. So yeah, Lydia's about to start some shit. Yep. So Shadow gave us a choice to either reset the timeline all the way back, or we could follow Zarcy's choice and reset the timeline back one day. Well, I feel like we haven't finished all of Zarcy's path, so let's reset the timeline back to one day. Hello? Zarcy? Did something go wrong? Is she really? Uh-oh. Peekaboo. Oh. Ugh. <laughs> What's the matter? Did you miss me? A little. Until you started saying peekaboo, then not really. Miss you? If it wasn't for your stupid little prank, maybe none of this would have happened. Oh. Hey. I was trying to help her loosen up. What's wrong with a little dangerous fun? Um. See, if... If I didn't knew about Lydia's trauma of why she's like this, then I would understand Zar I would be like, okay, Zarcy, I understand you, but now that I know about Lydia's trauma, ugh, it's just, mmm. Well, as we just witnessed, sometimes it can get a little too dangerous. True. Point taken. Let's go see Tanya. I'm sure she'll be able to help figure this out. I feel like I feel like Tanya's gonna be so pissed. No, Tanya. You and I will solve this together. Oh, uh, wait, what? But we don't even know what... Exactly. Willow, you trusted me this far. We can do this. Oh, this is bad. All we have to do is stop Lydia from freaking out about the lesbian villain in Avery's game. True. I really nailed her being one of us, didn't I? Well, lesbian, lesbian, yes. Demon, I don't think so. Uh, you think every girl is one of us? Duh! Haven't been wrong yet. Say what now? Lydia, what a pleasant surprise! Is that sarcasm I hear, Willow? What? Pfft, no. <laughs> uh, of course not. Uh, why don't you join us? I love the Im improvisation there. I just love improv. It's awesome. We're just playing a little fantasy role-playing game. It it's called... Yeah... Uh, dryads and Dreamers. Right, Avery? <clears throat> right? <laughs> uh, uh, yeah. Sure. Wow, that was the most unconvincing um, yeah, sure I ever heard of. That's really great how he, he delivered that line. Nice of you to invite Lydia. Hope it's not too much of a bother. Of course not. The more the merrier. Only... Lydia doesn't have a character sheet, does she? True. Uh... Well, we can just make one for her, right? That's true. Why not do that personality quiz? Or, she could borrow one of the ones I made. Wait, 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 wait. No! Wait, no, 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 right, right. Uh, uh, those belong to you. Oh, not to worry, Willow. I'm happy to share. Here, Lydia, why don't you take this one? Crap. Hold on. 
Your villain is a homosexual? Fuck. Oh boy, here we go. Let me handle this one, Willow. A homosexual? That's right. But don't get the wrong idea about that. We love queers at this table. I'm a queer. Actually, I'm like two queer people rolled into one. True story. <laughs> Say what now? And Avery here is a queer too. Oh. What? Willow, no I'm not. Not Not exactly, Willow. I think I think Avery's more trans, I think, cuz he really wanted to be um the uh oh my god, I forgot her name. Uh the fairy uh queen. I forgot her name. Sure you are. Come on. You don't have to be shy around us. I mean, I mean, I get what I get what Zarcy's doing, but it's that's the wrong label for Avery, I think. I think I'll be going now. Willow, how could you say that? I I like women. Hmm, see that? Oh boy. Great, so we didn't ruin Lydia's. We didn't ruin Lydia this time, now we ruin Avery. Great. Well, obviously. Who doesn't like women, right? Oh god, Zarshi, please stop, please stop, please stop. The fact that you like women is what makes you queer. I... No, no it do... No it doesn't. That doesn't make sense, Willow. That does not at all. I think I agree with Avery on this one. What are you doing? Right. You really don't know Avery very well, do you? Well, either way, at least we sent the right message to Lydia this time. I'm not too sure. I mean, yeah, she wasn't pissed off, but she was more... She was more like, mm, let's get out of here type of situation. So it wasn't good, but it wasn't horribly bad. But still, I didn't like the outcome of that. Yesterday's brouhaha was the last straw. Confirming this world is bereft of hope. Oh, God. You, Willow, cruelly outing your own friend, Avery. I mean... I mean, it did come out of Willow's mouth, but it was actually Zarcy that did that. But I see what Lydia means. Why would you do something like that to him? <sighs> see, that's the thing. I think Avery... Avery likes women, but not in... I think... I don't know. See, at first I thought he was trans, but now is ge is Avery gender fluid? Maybe I'm not too sure now. I was just trying to stop you from flipping out. Well, you failed. Oh boy, here goes World War Three. All right, come on, world. Let's let's just burn the world now. Kill her, Willow. Excuse me, what? What? Oh my god, this is this is the worst path ever. If you don't, she'll end the world again, right? <sighs> what are you waiting for? You have the power, use it. Oh. That's not going to work on her. Yeah, see, she's in Yeah, see. Anti magic is my magic. Exactly, see. Nothing you can do to harm me. How are you doing this? Because she's a very strong magical being. You really think you're the only witch at this school, Willow? Mm-hmm. There have been dozens of witches throughout the years, stopping World War III, stopping nuclear missiles from flying. Mm hmm Their enchantments encircle the globe, threads hanging in the air like a spider's web. All I have to do is tug on one of those strings, and it all ends. Thanks to my anti-magic, it should be easy. And Fuck. Let's try this again. Yep. What? What? No, Lydia, it don't matter. What the fuck was that? I know, right? No need to panic. 
We've just got to try a different approach. That's all. Okay, Zarcy, let me do the handling this time, because your way was absolutely horrible. We can't stop her from freaking out, and we can't kill her. I'm out of ideas. Well, then let's just keep her in the damn closet. Shit. Let her be the down low type. Godly. Fortunately for you, my imagination never runs dry. Okay, I know that was a dirty line, but at this at this rate, I'm not even, I'm not even laughing at that. I'm a little annoyed. Like, come on, Zarzi, do a b better job at planning, please. Kind of like. Oh God. Yeah, a sexual double entendre. I get it. Yeah, see, me and Willow are right there. Yep, we're 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 we're, we're thinking the same thing. Me and Willow. Can we just get to the chase? Right. What killed your mood? Um, um, how about um. Making Lydia star World War Three twice already. And we already had to re-race the timeline twice. Uh, getting killed certainly didn't help. Right. Now, what's the master plan this time? I say we go to Tanya. We do original plan. Go to Tanya. Either that or we just ask Shadow. I don't know. Enough with dryads and demons. We're doing something different. Oh, God. What are you, what are you planning now? Lydia, Avery and I are canvassing for the Environmental Lifeline Fund. Want to join? Oh, I forgot about that environmental thing. I don't see why not. Excuse me. Do you have a minute to save the planet? No? Okay, then. Excuse me, a, a minute for the planet? Pardon me, a, a minute for... Sir? Ma'am? Oh, boy. And that canvassing, as you called it. That just confirmed my worst fears. What? But we invited you, right? But those selfish people didn't give. They cared more about money in their pocket than saving the planet. Oh my god, so Lydia's gonna destroy the world. Oh my god. So, since they won't save the planet, you're going to just destroy it yourself? Right, that's not even, that wasn't our fault, that wasn't Avery's fault, that was no one's fault. It's just rich people just being rich people. I mean, just money-hungry people being money-hungry. Come on now. Precisely. Those wicked souls are going to reap what they sow. Oh my god. Are you kidding me, Lydia? Ugh, fuck. I know, right? This is, a, you know, this is annoying now. Hey, Lydia, want to go to a strip club? <laughs> That's even worse. Seeing those poor women treated like pieces of meat, that was just the last straw. Oh, God, yeah, Lydia's conservative. That ain't gonna work either. If that's what humanity is, we don't deserve to... Ugh, fuck. How about a nice trip to the beach? I swear to everything, if there is a single piece of trash on that beach. Seeing those poor homeless men off the interstate, that was just the last straw. Are you serious? Ugh, fuck! Oh my god, screw this. I'd rather just... I'd rather just hide in the damn closet myself. Hey, Lydia, wanna catch a movie? All right, there's a film that came out a few weeks ago that I really wanted to catch before it leaves the theaters. Let me guess, is it Passion of the Christ? It's called Groundhog Day. Oh, I'm surprised you didn't say Passion of the Christ, okay. He was forced to live the same day over and over. How fascinating. Yeah, how fascinating. Isn't that right, Willow? Living the same thing over and over? What I wouldn't give to have a power like that. Back off. That's my power. Your power is destroying the world. Keep that shit to yourself. Oh, trust me, it's not nearly as fun as they make it look in the movie. Uh, um, sh 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 Willow, shh. Not now. It's a living hell. Shh, Willow, Willow, let's not give her, give her any uh, thoughts about this. Willow, what on earth do you mean? R yes. What is it this time, Lydia? Don't wait until tomorrow to tell me. Was the popcorn not buttery enough for you? Were the chairs too squeaky? 
What excuse are you going to use this time for killing us? Willow, I... Out with it! Just tell me why I have to die. I don't know how you're doing this, but... Just a few minutes ago, I was thinking about how unfortunate it is that there's never any movies that have love stories with... Are you serious? You're gonna kill the world because there's no movies with love stories in it? Get... a... grip. Like, Lydia, I know you're traumatized by something in the past, which I'm totally sorry about. That is horrible, you do not deserve that, but come on, there's no reason to destroy the world because of no movies with no love stories. Like, come on. People like me. What do you mean? A conservative, God-fearing woman who is secretly a lesbian that's in the closet type of movie? Movie? I was thinking that, well, if I can't be accepted even in liberal Hollywood, then... Oh, then just destroy Hollywood. That's fine by me. Don't destroy the world. Destroy Hollywood, then. I'm kidding. Fuck, 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 fuck! Is she gonna just... <sighs> We've got to see her. Exactly, we need to see Tanya. Come on, give me one more try. Hell no. You said that like a dozen tries ago. Yeah, exactly. Let's end our... Oh, I didn't mean a quick save, sorry. I meant to save, there you go. Perfect. Alrighty, guys, I have to end my video from here, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Wicked Willow. Bye, everyone. My God, Lydia just wants the world to be destroyed at this point. Ugh.